it's tangible. So you can you can drive by it, you can see it, you can understand it. Most people, you know, especially if it's in the city in which you live, you've got to, hey, we know Green Lake's a great neighborhood, we know Evans is a great neighborhood, we're gonna buy a rental property there. Uh, and we are so fortunate here in Seattle and the whole Puget Sound region in that we've, we have very, very low vacancy rates. We've been in a, in a period the last five years where rents have increased. Property values have also increased, but our outlook here, you know, by all indicators, the three, five, 10 year outlook is extremely positive. So if you buy a rental property here today and you park some equity, park a down payment into that property, I think the odds are extremely high that not only are you gonna have some cash flow yep. on the holding of that property, but I think you're gonna have long-term appreciation. It's almost like, again, to use a stock analogy, it's like owning a you know a blue chip stock that also pays a dividend. You hope the stock value goes up over time, mm -hmm. but meanwhile, it's paying you mm -hmm. to hold it. It's paying you a dividend, and that's what rental property can do. And you get some tax benefits, some depreciation that offsets some of that income.